Hi, it's VoiceOver Sarah here. Welcome to Tandem Touring Through Europe, day one of our trip. We just got off our flight from Montreal, Canada to Bordeaux, France, and we are unpacking our bike and all our luggage that just got sent over. Uh, it took us quite a while to unwrap our bike and figure out everything. We had to reassemble parts of the bike as well, which took Trevor <laughs> a little bit of time, but we got there and we rode to our hotel for the night so we could have one major beautiful sleep before starting the stream tomorrow morning. Hi, now you're getting editor Sarah. I'm currently at a campsite editing because um, it's raining. Hi. <laughs> but we're going to switch to the VOD footage for the rest of this vlog. Um, I try to cut it down so you get like the highlights of the day. Um, so I'm hoping it's not too choppy. Um, I'm gonna switch right to the intro, which starts with a bit of a black screen because you know, live streaming. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you enjoy. Um, let's go. Is the first longer term trip with uh, not just me. Uh, it's me and Sarah here. Uh, and it's a special trip because we're doing weird things. I usually do weird things, but this is especially weird um, in the, you know, us just getting here. We've already had tons of people stop and they're like, huh? <laughs> a lot of people ask us questions and uh, we don't know what they're asking us because they speak a different language here. Anyway, this is day one of a brand new trip that I'm extremely excited for. Uh, I have lots to tell you about things, both good things and bad things, like how the bike got partially broken in transportation from Canada to this location. Uh, we're actually at a bike shop right now and they were working on it and they said, uh, well, they, they helped. Yeah. But they said without doing like a full half day's service or something like that, it, uh, it, well, it can't, well, it can be fixed, it just take a very long time. Uh, and they don't rideable. even know if they have the tools, but they said it's safe to ride. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Sarah, you've probably, well, if you've watched the at-home streams, you've seen Sarah. Uh, but if you don't know Sarah, this is my partner. We've been together a year and a half. Uh, we met on Tinder, as... As you do. <laughs> as you do in this day and age. It's pandemic times. Where are you going to meet people? Online's the best place to do it. Uh, now we live together. We share an apartment in Victoria, British Columbia, Canada. And, uh, yeah, we bonded over, you know, past travels. Sarah spent two years living abroad in Australia. And I think that's kind of where we first had our big... Um, yeah. You know connection. points of uh, of you know commonality connection yeah so sarah's gonna come on this adventure to uh, amsterdam and then we'll see what happens we might go further who knows oh yeah it, oh yeah by the way it's my 28th birthday today <laughs> june 20th i'm 28 i'm Romania. pushing 30. we've noticed um i'm getting a lot more white hairs mostly on the side of my head and in my beard uh and i'm just getting hair places that like just on my shoulders and stuff, it's growing out like significantly more than it was a year and a half ago when we first started seeing each other. And I'm like, Jesus, I am getting rather old. <laughs> oh, the problem that happened in shipping is the wheel uh, pretty much got knocked untrue and some of the spokes got loosened and stuff like that. We took it here and they did it up as much as they could, but when you spin the wheel freely, you can see it's got like a mm -hmm. as it spins around. It's got a little bit of a bend in it. Um, they're convinced it's not a safety hazard, um, which is my biggest concern. <laughs> I didn't want it to just fail spectacularly going down a hill. Um, yeah. yeah, they're saying even with the weight and the gear, it shouldn't be a safety problem in the state it's in. But um, maybe at some point along the way, if we take a day off, we'll take it to a shop. And yeah. they said they'll have to like take the whole wheel off and rebuild which the wheel. Which is hard because we have a weird wheel. Yeah, and they've never worked with a roll-off hub uh, that this bike has, so it's a bit different. Alrighty, we'll just strap down the water and then we'll be good to go. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Did he want a picture of it? Of what? Oh, did you say you wanted a picture? Or yeah, but uh, if you're okay, I take in when you will be both together oh, on, both on, it. on the bike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll be a better shot. Yeah. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> I want to see also how you claim the it. Oh, how we, yeah. <laughs> There's a little bit of coordinating and like to change gears, you have to both let off on the, the power for a fraction of a second yeah. to let it do its thing. I thought it was gonna be harder to start and stop. I heard tandems are kind of difficult to coordinate, like yeah. getting going, mm -hmm. but it goes pretty smooth. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see if it's got the clamps. So it does. <laughs> nice. We'll just start it over here so you can get a shot of us starting and going. <laughs> okay, now we can do this. And we can adjust the camera angle and everything, guys. Uh, it's just, uh, 
We're we didn't trial and error. Look. Yeah. yeah, we didn't even look at this. The framing. All right, Sarah. Okay. Yeah. Do, do, do. All right. We're on. <laughs> you ready to go? Yeah. All right. Three, two, one. Go. Let's go. So, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Don't die. I gotta adjust something because my heel struck the camera mount. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> but I just, I'm gonna get away from here. So I'm just gonna get to the end here and then I, I gotta change it because my heel's striking the, yeah. the thing. And you should see what the camera looks like. Does it look good? Can you see us? All right. I'll just go on to the sidewalk and okay. I'll have to muck some stuff around. How much am I striking? So I'm just gonna go slow a good bit. Okay. Which is annoying because it takes a bit to get that all set up. Yeah. Sorry, that was short, but <laughs> I didn't even test to make sure I had clearance for my heel and I don't. Okay, so we only made it like a block and a half and we had to stop to fix the camera pull mount because Trevor's heel was hitting it every time he'd rotate the pedals. Um, we stopped here for ages. It was like two hours of trying to rearrange this pole. It was a long time <laughs> and we just really wanted to get going. Anyway, I'm not going to let you sit through that. You're welcome. We're going to speed right on. We're gonna go in three, two, one. <laughs> well, it's going. Alright. Ah! <laughs> Trevor! <laughs> what was that? The lonely tears are lost in the abyss. The grass is always green. The house is always clean. The smiles never seem to fade. I just had no idea what you're doing. Yeah. Oh, ah. wrong way. You didn't three, two, one me. Sorry. Uh, yeah, my handle came off again. So uh, we stop him. Yeah. I was getting the bike into a taxi to get it to the ferry, and I pulled up on the handles, and it like pulled the shifty thing. And now, uh, it sometimes disconnects. Oh god. What was that? The top? I think so. Oh fuck, that's, oh no. Trevor. I just need to pull it out a little bit because it was out of sync and now yeah. it's in tall grass. I don't know how far that went. I thought I heard it. But... I don't know if we're gonna be able to find it in this. Anyone have a metal detector in Bordeaux? That's really bad thing to lose. We're unable to shift the bike. I don't know, man. Hit the pavement, but it came off with enough speed that I feel like it hit the pavement and then kept going. So you think it hit and then bounced this way? <sighs> I don't know, like, because I pulled it and it went like I that. I heard something hit the ground. Yeah, me too. It certainly went down. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what? People are saying it's, they think it's down there. They think it went all the way down? Yeah, like I pulled it off pretty hard because I needed to get it up to adjust the gearing because it was out of sync. And it's like, Six feet down there and filled with water. Tough. What? Do you think that's part of it? Yeah. So, yeah. I found that on the concrete here. Like right at the edge? Right here. Sarah I can found go down. A little o ring. Pretty much hanging out in the grass overhanging the ditch, so that means probably the rest of it's in the ditch. Oh, he <laughs> found it. <laughs> oh, we what? got it. Kay. I don't know if there's more parts missing, but. Hopefully oh not. god, dropped it again. Sure. 
This, <laughs> this freaking thing. After that huge mess up, we're finally back on the road. We rode the bike for an hour and something, I think. <laughs> it's been so long ago, if I'm being honest, now that I'm recording this voiceover that I don't really remember. But we rode for a bit and stopped along the way to take a snack break because we didn't really get to have lunch because of all the problems we were having. So here is part of the snack break. <laughs> Let's try. Oh, oh. <laughs> we're gonna have one of our baby foods. You are. Yeah, we got our baby foods. Strawberry, apple. <laughs> we wanted uh, um, apple sauce. Apple sauce. Squeezes. But we don't have a spoon, so. Well, I got a spork, but I don't think Sarah wants to share my spork. Mm. Oh, who's calling? Sarah's using. Uh, oh shit! <laughs> I think that's my dad. I got a. <gasps> Oh, no, it's your birthday. Uh, it is my birthday. Family's probably trying to call. My dad probably doesn't know I'm on a trip. <laughs> no one knows. <laughs> Does your Thank mom you. know? Yeah. Are you sure if you're back from home? I posted a picture onto Discord and I'll try and post it on another social media. Apple strawberry. Oh, look, it's got a kid with a head for a <laughs> strawberry for a head playing soccer. Nutrition score A. There you go. <laughs> it's a little bit of sugar. Cheers, Trev. Mm. Are you drinking right, but cheers? Kid snack. Kids helmet, yeah. So I just child. changed your helmet today because it felt yeah. more Sarah vibes. <laughs> it's meant to be a cycling helmet. It's not meant to be a skateboarding helmet. It's just meant to be more city styled. And it's pastel. My mom's so happy birthday. Oh, did? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, what a weird birthday this was. I forgot it was my birthday, really. It just at the very start of the trip, like it just doesn't feel like birthday. You know, it feels like a start of a trip, not a birthday. <gasps> but this morning, Sarah did bring out a card, which I didn't know she had. She snuck that one in. So. Mm -hmm. Were there ever really better days? Or are they just a mirror that we made? Stare it in the eye. Shatter all the lies And then go into the open wide beyond Hi again. Sorry for any um, background noise. I'm at the campsite and can't find a quiet place to um, hide. Anyway, Trevor and I did quite a bit of biking and we got to the town where we wanted to stay for the night. So we got a hotel and attached to the hotel was a restaurant so we just went there for dinner um so yeah we're just gonna switch to the restaurant scene now i cut a lot of the restaurant out so you're just gonna get a little snippet of it but yeah let's switch over yeah so we got a place to stay and now we, we, there's a place to eat right after or right next to it so uh we're eating and i'm <laughs> beering sarah's not sarah doesn't like beer um, Sarah doesn't like the taste of alcohol, but does like alcohol, right? Is that a fair assessment? That's fair. Okay. Anyway, cheers, cheers. Water, cheers. Yeah. Mm. Hi, it's editing Sarah again. Um, I'm just here to say thanks for watching. This is the end of the first day vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, <laughs> Hopefully the vlogs get better as I continue to learn how to edit again. Anyway, if you liked it, don't forget to hit that like button. Also, hit that subscribe button uh, so you get notified when I post new things. Hopefully more videos will be coming out and out. Uh, it takes me a while to edit these, so <laughs> yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye! Ever really better days Or is it just a sentimental hate?